Hello everyone, it is Tools uh, here. Today I have an opening of 2019 Tops Opening Day, last year's edition. A retail blaster box, 10 packs, one extra pack. Um, opening Day is always a fun little cool set, and this was a lovely gift from my lovely girlfriend for my birthday, which is today when I'm filming all these videos. So um, I appreciate it very much, and she's the best, and she supports my crazy hobbies, and she's awesome. Yeah, and I love her. So let's go ahead and open these up. She got me multiple ones, probably too much, so we're gonna have lots of videos to show you guys, but that's okay. To the the few people that do watch and watch me struggle opening boxes. A little X action there. There we go. She's going to be my lovely assistant for tonight, too, if I need help. She's sitting next to me as I'm watching me open carts. So we got our packs here. We will save the box as we will gladly use the cardboard to put the cards back in. Put that there. So we got our packs here. Should be 11. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 9, 10, 11. Pick one. It'll be the first one. I'm going to let her pick the first one. Okay, so here we go. Tops 2019 opening day retail blaster box. Probably from a uh, Target. I think out of uh, another state, actually, when she was on on a little trip. So we'll start off with the Chris Bryant. So most of these will be base cards, of course. We're looking for mascot cards and parallels and stuff like that. Rookie cards, Chris Davis. The only unfortunate thing about 2019 is that the rookie class is very weak as compared to 2018 and 2020. Uh, Paul Goldschmidt. So our first pack, we have an insert card, which is cool. It's a 150 Years of Fun Joe Morgan from the Cincinnati Reds. Uh, most people around my age will recognize Joe Morgan from being the color commentator on ESPN Sunday Night Baseball. So 150 years of fun, Joe Morgan insert. Inserts are always pretty cool. Usually opening day has one insert per pack, so we'll keep an eye out for those. And Andrew Benatende from my Red Sox. And Alex Bregman. And a Kyle Freeland. Again, I'm not sure there's anything on the back of these that are any special parallels or anything. Because um, this, like I said, is my first time I'm opening this product, so we shall see. So, got a cool Joe Morgan in the first pack. It's pretty cool. Next pack, we got a uh, rookie cup card of Glaber Torres, which means the year before he was the leading rookie in one of those categories. So, 2018 would have been his rookie card. But the cup cards are also um, pretty good and collectible. They usually hold a little more value, so those are cool. A Jan Moncada. Joey Wendell. And their insert is 150 Years of Fun, Reggie Jackson from the Yankees. These cards are cool looking. I like them. We got a Trevor Story, Alex Gordon from the Royals, and a Jesus Aguilar from the Brewers. All right, next pack. Got a JT Romito, Brad Keller, rookie card. Put the rookies aside, of course. A Williams Astolito rookie card. That's not a bad one. That's cool. Our insert card looks to be an opening day Atlanta Braves card. Yep, opening day insert. Their opening day was on March 29, 2018 against the Phillies. A Kyle Gibson. Freddie Freeman, and a Willie Adamas Gold Cup card, shortstop from Tampa Bay. So that pack had some rookies in it. That's cool. On to the next one. Miguel Cabrera, Steven Strasburg, very nice. Nolan Arnato. I know there's image variations stuff in this set too. I'm just not sure what they are. I'd have to go look them up. Um, 
150 Years of Fun insert, Francisco Lindor from the Indians. Again, apologies for the glare if that interferes at all. And Miguel Andahar, Gold Cup card. So him and Glaber each get one. Um, Yankees had a pretty good prospect class in the, the year before this, 2018. A Joey Lucchese from the Padres. And a Dakota Hudson rookie card from the Cardinals. That is not a bad one. Opening day is fun. I'm hoping for some mascot cards or a mascot autographed. Um, I actually have a uh, Wally from the Red Sox mascot autograph card from t 2020 opening day. I think he also has one in this set that I haven't seen uh, yet. Uh, Rowdy Tellez rookie card from the Blue Jays. Michael Lorenzen, Elvis Andrews. Our insert is Team Traditions and Celebrations Bobblehead Museum. We um, just pulled this out of our our Walgreens packs. So we got two of those now. That's cool. D. Gordon from the uh, Mariners, Evan Longoria, and uh, Aldemiz Diaz. Six packs left. All right, in this pack, we're kicking off with a Clayton Kershaw, Albert Amora, Jonathan Scoop, a Blue Jays mascot. I think that's the mascot insert. Yep, so they're an insert set just like 2020. That is the Blue Jays mascot. He just doesn't have a name, it just says mascot. And Billy Hamilton. Jose Abreu. And uh, Dansby Swanson from the Braves. Cool. So we did get a mascot. Not a, a jersey relic or an autograph, but still a mascot insert. So far it seems like this set has a more variety of insert as opposed to Opening day 20, um, 20. Uh, Reese Hoskins, of course, he was also, I think, in the class of 2018. Uh, Dylan Bundy, a Will Myers. We got a blue card. It is a Bryce Harper opening day parallel. These cards look very cool. It's got like that camouflage type checkerboard foiling to it, which you can see there. That's cool. It's a rainbow. Foil. It's not numbered out of anything, but it's still a blue parallel. That's easily the best card we've gotten out of this box. Cool, and it's a pretty good player in Harper. I'll put that in the good pile. And our insert also in that pack is a 150 Years of Fun Babe Ruth. So that's cool. And we get a regular Bryce Harper in this pack as well. And a Yusei Kokichi rookie card. He is one of the uh, better players from this class. So that is good. That is a very good pack. I always enjoy shiny cards. Definitely. Got a Wilson Contreras. Harrison Bader. Gold Cup card. Carlos Carrasco. We got another mascot insert. Paws mascot from the Detroit Tigers. Pretty cool. And we got a Charlie Blackman. David Dahl. And a Matt... Chapman. A couple packs left for you guys here. Ronan Odor. Nico Goodrum. Sean Doolittle. This is one I definitely like. A Pedro Martinez 150 Years of Fun. One of my all time favorite players. So that is cool when they won uh, the World Series. Very nice. And Michael Conforto. And Todd Frazier. And uh, Jonathan VR. Right, a couple packs left. I was happy to get that blue card in here. That's very cool. Salvador Perez. Nick Martini. Starlin Castro, 
We got an opening day New York Mets. Very nice. We got a David Peralta. Edwin Diaz and a Mitch Garver. Cool. Last pack. At least for this box. Many more to come tonight. Party is just getting started. Jose Ramirez. Nomar Mazzara. Uh, 150 Years of Fun Ichiro. And we have an autograph. Okay. We'll, we'll put that to the back. Orlando Arcia. Autographs are very rare in this set, so that is very cool. Um, a Cole Calhoun. And a Javi Baez. So here is our Ichiro insert. Very cool. Ichiro, one of my favorite players as well. Just an absolute hitting machine. And we got a opening day uh, Matt Chapman, it looks like. Opening day autograph from 2019 baseball. It is a um, sticker auto. Pretty cool. Chapman is a, a good player. Used to play um, for the Cardinals, I think it was. Um, yeah, just a veteran auto out of a, an opening day set. That's very cool. It's a very nice card. So uh, this box was uh, actually pretty good for, for opening day. Um, yeah, that's cool. So that's definitely the best card we got there. We'll put him there in the lineup for the top five here. This is actually, I really, I really like this set. It's pretty cool. Um, let's see. So definitely the Harper was also second best card in here, so that's very good. As well as the Kikuchi rookie card. And some of the insert cards are nothing crazy. Um, basically I'll pick out uh, the Pedro and the Ichiro here. Just at a, these are all probably, you know, willy-nilly. A couple of decent rookies. Anyways, but take a look at these hits here. We got the, uh, the Matt Chapman auto, very cool, and the Bryce Harper blue parallel, as well as the Kikuchi Ricky card and a couple um, of my favorite inserts there. So thank you all for watching. I would say this was a pretty pretty good successful box for opening day, and uh, I'm sure it was because uh, it was a lovely gift. Um, so anyways, thank you all for watching, and uh, peace out. Definitely look out for more videos. This was a very fun opening. Cheers.